the sun passes between the moon and the earth. And I'm going to be showing it to you right now. Hi, welcome to Michael's Adventures. I'm Michael. Today is Christmas Day. So I'd like to say Merry Christmas everyone! Yeah, for Christmas I got three movies, which is Secret Life of Pets, Finding Dory, and Alvin and the Chipmunks. Three movies that Triple B 780 wanted for Christmas. Yeah. And I also got a poodle, which looks like this. And I also got a stuffed animal that holds my iPhone while it's charging. But sadly for me, I did not get the stuffed animal collection of the Olympic mascots, which is a huge bummer. It was like Dad wanting a dozen minions for Christmas. I mean, he threw a tantrum saying, What a jap! And all that. Yeah, I think Dad's tantrum on Christmas is a lot better than DW's I want a Tina the Talking Tabby tantrum. So maybe there's next Christmas. Yeah. And I also got my new video camera which is why it looks like Battlefield Earth. Although the background's too dark. Let me turn it on. Yeah, it feels like I took Super Mario Logan's camera away. Yeah. What's wrong with my red camera? I'm sorry, it's tilting. I need to learn how to vlog with this camera. Anyway. I don't want it to look like Battlefield Earth. Anyway. What happened to my red camera? Well, it was broken. I mean, it's dead. Let me put it to you that way. So, today I'm going to honor my camera. And also, Merry Christmas, everyone! And enjoy the vlogs I posted with my camera. So, I'm Michael. That's all for this edition of Michael's Adventures. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Michael's Adventures. Thanks for watching. Bye.
se nakkaa. And also, I laughed at the part where Greg's mom embarrassed him. And five, six. What? What the heck? Twelve. Eleven, ten. And now I'm lost. Oh, ha! There it is. And the movie's playing. So, yeah, I like the Hunger Games. So, I need to go in and I'm sorry I pose like that because I have a lot of crud in my hands. So, maybe I'll just waltz right in and find my mom. It's the moon and the earth. And I'm going to be showing it to you right now. Say hi, everyone! Hello. Hi. MJ, you're on video. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, these are my friends at Toastmasters. You notice that the United Nations is more noisier than this college room. It may be just like headquarters from Disney Pixar's Inside Out. Anyway, I felt like I was on graduation and they handed me and all that sadly for the kids that means they are not going to have a snow day snow day which my friends might say thanks Obama but President Obama and now I'm liking the Carly Fiorina song, which luckily she sang once. And reason why? Because my dog is lazy. How come? Well, I fed her and I didn't hear Sasha running up going mmm food instead she was like this And I saw it. Man, am I in the Carly Fiorina song. Because one of her pets might have been running around presidential candidates. Well, there's Bernie Sanders, Hillary Clinton, and Martin O'Malley. I'm not telling you who to vote for, and I am not telling you who I'm voting for. Because it's top secrets and the good ones. If they leave, I would end up stuck in the foam pit, which I don't have a problem with. And I thought about. Starting off with verbs.
Why? Tener is to have. Ser means to be. Why? Yo soy. I am. Tu eres. You are. Nosotros. We are. Ustedes son. You guys have. And Gustar. It's me, te, le, nos, and les. And this, that's my first foreign Pixar flick. And I was so proud of myself. So Inside Out doesn't have Sunday Sue to Sue. And I try to keep myself from mimicking the bad stuff out of it because I'm prone to it since Arthur. And I'm thinking about pinching my side when I would think about yelling, Ya Sierra La Boca! Or trying to run away, calling, text someone, Oscoma! And Osco is Spanish for disgust. So it's European Spanish for disgust. And I try thinking about the happy stuff, like like the time I was at my grandfather's house and Grandma Magda. I think, speaking of rich and soft and snuggly, we're getting to my favorite part of being buried in pillows, the sinking part. How come, Michael? Well, it's because it's softer that way. And I figure the more I bury myself in pillows, the snugglier it feels. Although I'm not claustrophobic like my mom. So it's a good thing. And I think I'm 99% buried and now you can see me. <laughs> Peekaboo! Now I'm really buried. Feels like I'm claustrophobic, but I'm not. I'd rather be afraid of spiders, like Ron Weasley from Harry Potter. Which, anyway, it also feels like I'm in Devil's Snare for pillows. But. It didn't strangle me, it's just muffling my sound and also, oh gosh, and also blinding me and deafening me. Which, kudos to him. 
Because that's what I would do if I were Seth Rogen. And probably until Justin Bieber cries. You're like, ah! team is not playing. Why? Because Tony Romo messed up the Cowboys. This is <clears throat> this is stinky poopy quarterback activities. It was like I can't throw football. Somebody teach me. And there's one spoof about him in the photo of Caitlyn Jenner saying, Call me Tanya. With Tony. <gasps> And also, the Super Bowl commercials are getting really, really stupid. Why is that? Because last year, Kim Kardashian was doing the commercial, and she was showing off her big butt. It's like, oh my gosh. I mean, she does have a big butt. It's He's blue. And we don't mean sadness. He means... It means he's... Blue and furry. And speaks Mandarin. So... Little pig! Little pig! Little pig! Let me in! Boo! Oh, you don't scare me. Penny! 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 <clears throat> Sorry. I'm too old for my voice cracking. Penny! 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 Sheldon! 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 I want to thank her for taking me out to see Inside Out. The first night, we were expecting Floyd to meow and meow and meow. But he got used to the place. She and she's thinking, what are you doing, Michael? She came from Florida, and my dad labeled her s snotty because she snots all over him. And I'm following her, and she's taking... We're so happy. And for good night, it's... Good night, Malia. Good night, Sasha. I love you. And guess what? I killed Bin Laden. Yeah.
What about imprisoning George W. Bush and Dick Cheney? Also, that's still my opinion. My mom grew up with Lyndon B. Johnson when she was little. And started school when Richard Nixon took office. Now, Richard Nixon has a middle name that's later used for for Millhouse, the best friend from The Simpsons. And also, Lyndon B. Johnson was like Bernie Sanders back in the day. Always was for education. He was John F. Kennedy's vice president until Kennedy was assassinated by a sniper. And Lee Harvey Oswald. And Lee Harvey Oswald. And my mom likes it when her father, when this Jacob taking off his shirt, saying, Why are you taking your shirt off? Put your shirt back on! And then, yeah! turn into a wolf. Which, I'm sorry, you might hate me for that, but but behind the scenes they revealed Jacob as the great Teletubby. <laughs> yeah. So I thought I guess they turned Jacob into a were Teletubby. <laughs> oh no, the moon! It's Peaky! Uh oh! You may wonder. Anyway, my thought about it was. You mean to say that Ag was really like District 2? My thought on Mom's question, not the movie. The movie? It was pretty good. I mean, it has Katniss showing off her bravery. And you may wonder what I mean. What's my favorite scene from the Hunger Games? Number one, it's the makeover when Katniss was getting waxed. Number two, the hey Zeus, get off my cloud. Or. Tad's the way, uh-huh, 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 I like it. But it's more like, hello? Yeah, um, uh, I need to speak to my friend whose name's, um, <laughs> What? 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 Come on, spit it out! Spit it out! His last name's Key Bum, and his first name's Lee. 
All right, <laughs> just a second. Anyone here, leaky bum? <laughs> and the bar flies were laughing. <laughs> yeah. Although, that episode has Stewie. Finishing the phone call. Doing a rape joke and... And I was trying... You wanna build a snowman? Come on, let's go and play. I've never seen you anymore. Come out the door. It's like you've gone away. We used to be best buddies. And now we're not. I wish you would tell me why. Do you want to build a snowman? It doesn't have to be a snowman. Okay, bye. There might be a force ref force response, which is not claw. Which means, of course, y'all means, yes, ambition means a little, and nine means no. Or, I'm sorry, it's astute mir- Yeah. Anyway, I thought about reviewing on my vlog in the style of Toastmasters and my earlier vlog about Dire of Wimpy Kid. For a compliment, I had to say it's very, very awesome. And, and it showed me that Hank's not really a sourpuss, just a cautious octopus afraid of hands, which I don't know why. I mean, dogs and cats. Or wanting to be petted. Being touched by fish. Like on the Shark Week episode, they were testing to see if there are movements of humans that attract to the sharks. Like what you see on Soul Surfer when Anna Sophia Robb was waving her hand underwater and then chomp! Versus playing dead. So the reason behind it is that sharks detect fish in distress. We were often mistaken for fish or seals in distress. Sort of like underwater pterodactyls. Yeah. The tsunami provides. And when he was touched by a shark, he was like, ah! Jumping. It's like jumping in a giant mud bath. Although I might have clothes on it. I don't mind getting dirty. Like... Like my least favorite long sleeve shirts. 
Or I could go. Syndrome. Chick Hicks. Chef Skinner. Otto. Charles Muntz. Lots. The Texas A&M Aggies being creamed by the LSU Tigers. I mean, I mean on Duck Dynasty, the Robertsons were rooting for the LSU Tigers. And that little slip up by Phil Robertson has caused me to dislike Duck Dynasty. Therefore, the LSU Tigers. Like Spanish or Greek. Anglite means, yep, you guessed it, English. What can you do to make the sentence more polite? Well, it's easy. Add sliha, which means, excuse me. So, sliha, at metaberet. Anglit? Excuse me, do you speak English? If you're talking to a man and... Actually, I was playing in my room. Mom was watching. My dad was on graveyard. And my sister was playing in her room. I don't know what I was doing while while they were playing games like Party Quirks or Let's Make a Date or Scenes from a Hat or Hoedown, but I have a feeling I might have been snuggling with stuffed animals. Pockets. And I don't know what happened after that other than us high-fiving and coursing. Miss Melts? Miss Melts, more. We're done. Yeah. I don't know what would have happened if I would have graduated with memory. But all I know now is she's my long lost best friend to express how grateful you are to to help someone out or give someone what they want. You would say, Maraming Walang Anaman. Bo if it's for formal. Musta, it means, How are you? Magandang Aho. Good morning. Umanga. After, it means good noon. Tanghali, afternoon. Hapon, it means good evening. And Gabi means good night. Although, I didn't use Magandang, it's used in 
front of to the doctor and the doctor said it's going to be a boy so she let us know on Facebook and again I said congratulations because that's what best friends do say congratulates to them on their happy lives and what kind of a best friend would would not care and checking on my intestines right now not checking your intestines it's like I'm at the emergency room. Okay, let me listen to your heart, okay? Alright. You pickles? I'm sorry, I'm just a little ticklish right now. Okay. She's feeling... Also, I'm prone to get bad stuff from television like for example I was taking loads of bad crud from Arthur like my grandmother hated Arthur since when they were drawing unflattering pictures of Francine as a blob. Although they are anthropomorphic, they also do what's, what animals would do which is pick on what their species normally eats. For example, like the fox from Zootopia is standing around and he sees a hare. He would trip her. And speaking of predators, they also have that serum, which is kind of like the purple one from Despicable Me 2. But instead of turning purple, looking like beetles between my legs and around my legs, sort of like the number eight. And this is both which is called around the world. Why? Because it's going all the way around me. Although it's around the world. So you might think of me like the world and my basketball, the moon or the satellites. And in the basic one, it's this. Sorry. So we get a camera right. Busa, which is cat in Filipino. Gato, Spanish. Shot, French. And all that. Out of 
Alvin and the Chipmunks. Or actually, sounding a bit like them. Now, is what Floyd would do. But Floyd would bounce. Anyway, I got used to Tony the Tiger, and that's the name of the Gunter mascot, and I cracked a joke, and the cheerleaders were like, <laughs> you're funny, Michael. I'm Michael Walker. That's all for this edition of Michael's Adventures. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Michael's Adventures. Thanks for watching. Bye. My favorite color is black. Because he thinks it goes quite well with purple. My mom's favorite color is maroon. Because she's an Aggies fan. And her second favorite color, gray. I guess he's camera shy. Well, he wants to run away from the camera because he's shy. Well, I walk him for exercise and he needs... But in real life, it's not funny. Because you never know if there are snakes. And you may not know if someone can't swim. So think of empathy although we don't have a rainforest on the other side of the tree is a big water spout which sounds like a waterfall And trees tend to have palm leaves. And I'm actually going to the movie theater right now. This is Mockingjay, a Jennifer Lawrence film. It's rated PG-13. So... Also, I would challenge that what? Happy Mother's Day! I love you all. I'm Michael Walker. That's all for this edition.
this is my year to experience this. It's the first time I've had, I had a full uh, body massage this oh, year. Yeah. It's the first time ever. It was awesome. <laughs> yeah, I feel like going to sleep too. <laughs> I feel like my back's getting hotter. Oh yeah? Yeah. Does it hurt? No. It feels just like cupping. You know those spa treatments? I mean, I've never been to a spa. I've been to one. Okay. I got a Swedish <laughs> massage and a facial. Oh, I want a Swedish massage. Really? Mm -hmm. Do I do facial too? Or do we do a lot. We do waxing too. Mm. We never had that so nice. Waxing, we do a bunch of machines. Is this too hot for you? No. So we do micro Super duper nice. Christy, crock it to the front, please. So does it help turn my back show um our lead to the front, please. Different color? No. Um, it still brings you down. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I want that. You want this? I, uh, no, she's just had a fish in the floor. Pretty bad. I got it. Watch your hair. Sorry. <laughs> Not my hair. My hair's so long. <laughs> Turning into Rapunzel. In school! I'm Michael. That's all for this edition of Michael's Adventures. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Michael's Adventures. Thanks for watching. Bye!